So looking at making a playlist to make it easier to show videos in your classroom, well, sometimes it works well. Sometimes when you have content made for kids, it can be a little troublesome. What do I mean? So I'm gonna go ahead here and I'm gonna search for rhyming words. So I'm gonna go rhyming word songs and I'm gonna go ahead and take a look at the video. I'm gonna say, all right, this looks like a good one and I play it. So when I go ahead and hit play here, I have an option down here. Notice that when I try to hit save, it says actions turned off for content made to kids. And you're like, well, I really wanna make this playlist. So what we're gonna do instead is I'm gonna go back here to YouTube and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and hit search again. And instead of actually clicking on the video to add it to the playlist, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and go over here to the song and then you have these three dots to the right. I'm going to click on those three dots and I can go ahead and click on save to playlist. Here I can go ahead and create a new playlist and I'm going to call it rhyming. Here I can set this playlist to private, meaning only I can see, public, anyone in the world, or unlisted. Unlisted in public will give you a link that you could share out with anyone else you'd like. For example, your kindergarten team or your middle school language arts team. I'm gonna go ahead and go ahead and set this as unlisted. And I'm gonna click on create. So I just added that one to the rhyming song and I'm gonna go down here for um, this rhyme time one that I've already viewed, I'm going to go ahead and three dots, save to playlist, and I'm going to go ahead and add that to the rhyming songs. And you'll see that it's added on there. Now, when I go here to rhyming songs, my playlist here on the left hand side, I can see these two videos listed here. It is listed as unlisted. I can take this link right here and share that out with anyone in my team. If I wanna edit this, um, I can add a description. I can change right here if I want it listed to public and it just depends on how you'd like to use your playlist. And again, these playlists come up really well and work well on your Promethean board.